Oh, there were so many classic shows. The I Love Lucy show. Love it. Forgive us. One of the things that... When she worked at the factory. Yep. <laughs> How about the Vitamin and Benjamin? Lucille Ball, my husband Desi. And uh, by the way, the family in the show, they lived in this neighborhood on 68th Street. Well, sort of. If you really took that address it would be in the East, East River. River. Right, it was 600-something right. or other. Yeah. The numbers don't go that high, but still, lived in our neighborhood. Anyway, we are thrilled that we actually know um, Lucy Arnaz, daughter of Lucille and Desi, and uh, an actress in her own right who's doing something very special in New York. Welcome to Good Day. Thank you very much. Welcome Thanks back to Good Day. Me. Yeah, nice to be here again. Well, nice to have you back on Broadway. Yeah. This is, what, the fourth time you've been in a Broadway show? Yeah, the fourth time, and um, I'm actually doing the national tour of Pippin all around the country. But the lady who uh, started this role last year in Pippin won a Tony Ford. Andrea Martin wanted to play Los Angeles. And so the producer said, well, why don't we put her in Los Angeles and bring you to Broadway? I went, oh, very well, but I'll make a fuss. You know, it was great. So it was the perfect. We just crossed over, and I joined uh, their, tour, their company here. And she That's so ours. funny because you just moved to the West Coast. Yeah, and I know. It's crazy. <laughs> Are you, is this a limited run, or this is forever? This, well, no, I'm going back to the tour, so this is a limited run. I'm in the Broadway company for four weeks only, Oh. Uh, and I'm, I'm out of it from the 30th of uh, October through the 3rd of November because my husband is turning 80, and we're having a huge, big family birthday for him, and oh. I have planned that forever, and I'm not missing it. Wow. Oh, that's so wonderful. But I'll be here for four weeks except for those that weekend, that Halloween weekend, I'm not there, but um, it's great. We opened last night, and you know, it's, it's like a parallel universe. It's the same show that I've been doing in Denver and San Francisco, and a wonderful company on the road, and yet all, all the costumes are the same. The faces are completely different. <laughs> it's very exciting. When they asked me to do it, I couldn't believe it, because it, I play, as you can see on here, I play a grandmother as well as a troop player in Pippin, but there's um, my scene, my one big sort of cameo scene of my own, there are some very unusual um, physicalities involved that I never thought I would do it. Like age. what? Give us an idea. I won't spoil it, but there is a trapeze bar involved, very oh, high what? in the air. Well, I hope there's a net involved as no, well. No, there is not, <laughs> or any sort of hook on things, and I have a partner. And they have to train for that in the four weeks that I got ready for the show. Are you nervous about it? I mean, you're in great shape. You know shape. what? I you learned, are in great shape. Thank you, but I'm in better shape now because of this show. Thank you, Pippin. <laughs> um, what I learned from doing this is that it could be terrifying, but I think about each moment as I get to it. Where do I put my hand? Where do I look? Where does my foot go? And it's a great metaphor for life. Don't think too far ahead. <laughs> you know, it's like be in the now. You're safe in the now I and mean, prepare. Train, prepare, know what you're supposed to do, and then stop worrying about it. Just be present. In I like that, doing. Lucy, very much. It's true, right? Uh, but, but everybody is human, and you have your off days. That's what I always worry about, the off days. You know, when I just you don't worry have a good night's sleep. You know? I more worry about the off days that the guy who's holding me has had. <laughs> like I hear the you. pilot in the plane. I hear you. Uh, <laughs> tell us a little bit about uh, growing up in... That, How little that would you household. like to know? <laughs> yeah, I, I know you're not too expansive about it, but uh, and I understand we respect no, 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 your privacy, no, no. but I, they I, look like great people. I'm very expansive. I wrote a whole documentary and produced it and won an Emmy. Thank you very much. Yeah, I know, but people bring it up all the time. Must get a little tiresome. But do me a favor, just tell me a little bit about your what mom. What do you want to know? That's the thing that's hard to say. It's specifics. People always say, "Ooh, what was it like to?" Grow? And I have to go. Wait, let's just stop. First of all, the fact that you have that big smile on your face makes me think that you want the happy story, which I can give you. Do you want to know what kind of car we drove? Do you want to yeah. know? Let's start, yes. <laughs> Let's start with the car. Let's start with the car. Okay, you guys go on vacation together? Of, of course. Where'd yes, you go? Where'd you absolutely. like to go? Actually, it was great because when they had vacations, I was very spoiled because I thought that when you're in show business, you get every second weekend, off, you know, every second week you get a two-week vacation, <laughs> <laughs> and you had Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday off after work. Doesn't happen like that anymore. But we had a house in Palm Springs, which is where I just moved wow. to. Uh, my father built a beautiful house there. We went on weekends, and we went to Del Mar, California, on the beach for the whole summer every year, and those were the best times of my life. Wow. Yeah, because they could relax and just be themselves and fish and not worry about all that stuff and did, get away from it. Did your parents want you to get into the business? You know, they didn't force us at all, um, and I, but they encouraged. They, they supported our passions, whether it be drumming or, you know, tap dancing or whatever it was. And my, my mother always said, you can do anything you want to do. You can do anything you want to do, and that doesn't happen a lot with parents. Mm -hmm. A lot of times parents try to save their kids and say, oh, God, you'll never be an actor, or that's a terrible business. You know, they try to warn you so, God forbid, you don't get hurt. Yeah. They don't want you to get hurt, but my parents were very supportive. If that's what you want to do, I'll bet you could do it. My father used to say, nobody can do it any better. 
you know? <laughs> and that was just really, that's a, you need that self-esteem, especially in this business with all the rejections. Wow, they seem like great people. Well, thank you, they Lucy. Were. And uh, we can see you on Broadway right now in Pippin. In Pippin. Which theater is that, by the way? It's at the Music Box Theater right next door to the Imperial where I did their playing our song for a year wow. and a half on Broadway. It's and really you're great. doing eight shows a week. Eight shows a week, matinees, <laughs> Saturdays and Wednesdays and Sundays. Man, that's intense. It's great. Okay. It's a, such a wonderful company. It's well, really great. It's so nice to have you back on Good Day New York. We Thank appreciate you. it. Thank you. Thanks for best. having me back. Uh, and go see her in Pippin. We'll put the information on tickets on our website, myfoxny.com.